Hey guys, Tez here, and I've got a team deathmatch on the map Bakara or Bikara, but I'm going to call it Bakara for now because that's how I would say it. I'm using the uh, or a submachine gun, I should say. I know I picked the M4 off the bat, but I do change it up pretty shortly. I'm using the MP5 with a red dot and the proficiency kick, I think, so that'll be the reduced recoil one. And I'm not quite sure my perks actually. Might be sleight of hand blast perk thing and marksman no stalker the one where you aim down sight and you walk faster but i'm just using this submachine gun because the maps on modern warfare 3 at the moment the ones that i've seen are a lot smaller than any other call of duty well not any other call of duty but a lot smaller than black ops and uh, modern warfare 2 so it kind of allows for submachine gun gameplay more and I found that I've done better with a submachine gun than I have with like an M4 or a different assault rifle. So chose the MP5 for this game. It's the first time I've actually used it apart from actually getting the red dot sight. But this is the first full game I've played with it and I go on like a 12 or a 13 kill streak straight away. And I'm just really enjoying the submachine guns and the flow of the game. Black Ops we all know that it was quite a slow play slow paced game sorry and that you had to kind of move around quite a lot for your fighting and things but in infinity ward titles the game seems to be a lot more fast paced and that's carried over from to modern warfare 3 i should say and it just feels like such a more action packed and enjoyable game from what i've seen so far i'm not making any massive assumptions i'm not going to be saying oh this is the best COD ever because I want to. I want the game to kind of sink in, and for any problems to be found before I make some statements like that. But this game, at the moment, I've had lots and lots of fun doing it, playing it. I should say I haven't played that much because it's my brother's copy, because my one still hasn't arrived yet. Stupid website Zavi. I'd recommend not using them for pre-releases or pre-orders. I should say. But I'm going to talk about the submachine guns and the the damage that they do. In this game, everything has stopping power built in, but it still takes more bullets to kill somebody than it did in Modern Warfare 2. And I, th I like it that way. I think it's better that way because it kind of goes back to a bit more of COD 4 style. Modern Warfare 2 was like, you, shoot, you see somebody, you shoot them, they're dead. Or somebody sees you, you're dead. And this, it gives you a little bit of a chance to at least fight back and to say turn around and just run away and I'm, I'm really enjoying that in this game I think it's it's such a good thing that they've brought back that guns take more time or more bullets to kill so yeah the submachine guns that I've used so far are just the mp5 which would be this one and I picked up a, a UMP I think I picked one up in a minute actually and the UMP with a silencer I found that it took quite a lot of bullets to kill people. It, it was quite a lot. I was a bit surprised. I was like, oh, how didn't he die after I put like seven or eight bullets into him? And I think that's a good thing, actually. It just, it means that you have to be better. You have to be more skilled and get more shots on target. So hopefully that will play out really well and, and the game I will enjoy for a long time to come. My kill streaks this game were um, Sam Turret, which is seven because I'm using the support kill streak, an advanced UAV which is 12 and the airdrop ship gun thing I don't actually know what the name is but it comes in and it drops like a ton of care packages and I pick up all of them I think I get a couple UAVs and another gun of some sort or helicopter I should say and I'm really enjoying all the new guns or all, all the different sounds of the guns and the recoil that the guns have I know a lot of people were saying it's just Modern Warfare 2.5, but with the new recoil, the new sounds, the new gun looks, I, I honestly think it's just, it is a completely new game, and I will enjoy playing this for a very long time. Ah, it was a recon drone, that was what the little chopper thing was. Does, it, does anybody know how to use these things, or what they do? If you could just like leave a comment below telling me what they actually do, that'd be pretty cool, because I don't know. I was just hovering over this guy, I locked on to the target, but I didn't know what it was doing. So I kind of got bored and just got out of it about now. But yeah, this game from what I've played, it's, it's extremely fun. Definitely do not go into the game thinking that you will post up good scores like you did in Modern Warfare 2. I went into 
playing this game with that opinion or that mindset. And I got a little bit frustrated because I wasn't getting such high scores as I usually did in Modern Warfare 2. And I think this is about a four kill streak on the mountain machine gun. So I'll do that nice clip. But I was getting a little bit frustrated because I wasn't doing as well as I did in Modern Warfare 2. And you just got to completely just forget about any previous games and kind of play it or play this game for what it is. It's going to be different because obviously the guns take more bullets to kill somebody. So people aren't going to drop as quickly. So you're not going to get as many kills in such a short space of time. So kind of just go into this game with an open mind and you really will enjoy yourself playing this game. The recoil is, is really good. It's really hard to shoot somebody quite far away with a submachine gun and that's how it should be. That's that's kind of how submachine guns are supposed to be used. So as you can see here, it took quite a few bullets to take that guy out. I'm just going to finish off this commentary by basically just saying subscribe to my channel, really. This this is going to be more, more videos. I'm going to put two more videos up tonight. And then tomorrow I'll be putting up about three or four videos. I have university in the morning, but I get back about lunchtime. And then I'll be uploading for the rest of the day. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, I'm not doing anything apart from playing this so I'll be uploading constant videos all the time and if you like the comment or I would say the commentary and if you like the the quality of my videos then definitely like the video subscribe and I can guarantee you there'll be more videos like this coming very shortly I'm gonna finish off by asking you a question for you to comment in the comment section below I'm gonna ask you what is your favorite gun that you've used so far and why basically so if it's the the submachine gun because you like to rush then just say submachine gun because you like to rush or maybe it's one of the guns in the higher higher levels and just say that and then let me know why but this game's coming to a close guys it's quite a high scoring game i think i'd get another 17 point streak but get the final kill before so that's about a 37 kill game maybe maybe more so let's just wait until the score pops up got some challenges and I go 35 and something but anyway guys please like the video subscribe for more and I'll see you guys